One of the biggest problems that I see clinically is patients who've had this dreadful experience of being awake during an operation and they've got usually full recall of what's happened. And it's very easy to underestimate how severe a situation that can be. Um, not so long ago I heard um, of a case in the United States where a man had, following his surgery, had gone to a bathroom had taken out a shotgun and shot himself dead because he just couldn't cope with the emotional consequences of what he'd experienced. And I'm regularly seeing patients whose lives are absolutely devastated by a single experience of being awake, maybe for as much as half an hour, three quarters of an hour on the operating theatre table, unable to move and unable to signal to anyone their predicament. And that makes the situation all the more worse because there are people around you who you trust, they represent the medical profession, the establishment, and here they are inflicting severe psychological damage. Uh, and yet, there's nothing that you can do, and it, it seems that there's nothing that they can do because they don't know that you're awake. So there are severe psychological problems that accompany an episode of awareness. And I'm regularly in my clinics treating patients who've had that sort of experience. Essentially, they're experiencing a severe form of what's known as post-traumatic stress disorder. And so we use psychological techniques to try and uh, mitigate some of the damage that uh, is caused by that experience.